Hi everyone, I welcome you to the Backstories from the Wild. This scene was set up along a small stream uh, in the Western Ghats. It was about how the lion-tail macaques uh, wanted to feed on jackfruit, uh, although they had to get into the stream to have their share, which is uh, uh, not a very common sight because they don't get into the water that often to feed on jackfruits. At least, uh, we don't really uh, observe them very often. I wanted to specifically film the lion-tailed macaques feeding uh, while they were on the stream because uh, these are arboreal animals. Lion-tailed macaques usually stay up in the canopy, so filming them on the ground was something uh, crucial for me to show. All I was thinking was to uh, get multiple angles so that I could build the entire sequence in uh, which location they were and how they were feeding on this jackfruit, uh, showing the entire background and the stream that they were on. I sat in the stream while there were so many leeches climbing all over me. Uh, once in a while I could pick it up, but then the other times I was handling the camera so I couldn't really do much. Just let the leeches be on and started looking into my viewfinder and filming them. Since the macaques were comfortable with my presence around them, uh, they were just uh, feeding as they would uh, normally do. They were just munching away into the jackfruits. So that was really beneficial because that was the most important approach, like keeping the animals comfortable and uh, not disturbing them while they are naturally behaving in their environment. I wanted to build the sequence quite holistic. I wanted to get it multiple uh, angles from uh, different spots so that that would give the entire sequence a whole growth uh, which is normally what I do in most of my sequences uh, if there is the luxury of the animal behaving uh, the same way for a long time. Since my approach was precise I was able to get as much behavior as possible from uh, the lion-tailed macaques feeding on the stream uh, without even disturbing the slightest bit. So. By the end of the day, I was really happy that I was able to build such a beautiful sequence in such a location because the next year that I went to the same location to film something similar, the entire stream was uh, overgrown by a bush. So I was really happy that I was able to be there during the right year and film during the right time. 